Hi, I'm Mickey Edwards. I'm a former member of Congress. More important, I'm a real believer in the American form of government. And one thing that's really unique about this form of government is that we don't protect the government from the people. We protect the people from the government. And that means giving people who have an interest in what government does, who could be hurt by government or uh, government could, could serve them uh, a little better, a chance to make their voices heard. And I'd like to come talk to you about that. For 15 years, I've taught at Harvard, at Princeton, at Georgetown, and I always start each class with the first thing. I write the word passion on the board, and I tell students, and I tell other faculty members, that changing your society comes from your heart and your passion. And I follow the advice of a British writer named Bernard Crick, who wrote a book called In Defense of Politics, in which he said, politics is the way a free people govern themselves. That's what we need to learn. One of the things I've written about and very passionate about is giving people in our communities, our society, in business, in advocacy groups, in, in uh, all kinds of organizations who can be affected by government, a chance to be heard, a chance to have a place at the table, a chance to be able to organize with other people, frame their messages so that people in government take their views seriously. You know, there was a time when America was the superpower and we could do what we wanted in the world, whether you know, we should have or not. You know, we're not there anymore. There are other major powers. There are a division of, of abilities, whether it's economically, military, trade, uh, what we need to do as a country is to improve our ability to interact with the rest of the world because from here on, it's interdependence, it's not independence. If you're in business in the United States, the chances are you are going to be dealing more and more every year with people in China, in India, in the Middle East, in Latin America. Too many Americans don't understand how to work in the rest of the world, how to interact with the rest of the world. You know, that leaves you far behind in the global trade uh, if you can't learn how to be a player in the global economy that now exists. 